Rebel Nation. My name is Ross Bjork. I'm your Athletics Director here at Ole Miss. And I'm Keith Carter, Executive Director of the Ole Miss Athletics Foundation. We're here today to give you a walking tour of the pavilion at Ole Miss and show you all the progress that's been happening the last nine months to make Ole Miss a better place. Let's go for a walk, Keith. Let's do it. All right. So Ross, our first stop here today is in the loading dock area between the parking garage and the pavilion. It'll be used for both. Tell us a little bit about what this function will be uh, for this spot uh, in the garage and you know, the pavilion. As you know, Keith, as we were designing this whole complex and, and really looking at a master plan for all of athletics, one of the key pieces for us was where do we take those TV trucks that were always parked in the parking lot and where do we move them to? And as we developed this whole area, this became a natural uh, spot for this loading dock area. So what you see here is a place where we can park five TV trucks, we can park team buses for basketball, we can park our, our coaches and our athletic staff who work the game, and essentially all the TV trucks have to do is they drive down this ramp behind us, they have a turning radius down here, and they plug into the wall, and it's a plug and play mechanism. Yep. So they plug right in and they connect right to the football stadium, they connect to the pavilion, and we're broadcasting on ESPN, on the SEC network, and it's a really just a, a multifaceted area that's going to be used throughout the year to make our athletic program better. All right, Ross, now we are underneath the parking garage. This is the staging marshalling area for the pavilion. Talk about what goes on down here. So, you know, really a, a basketball arena, the pavilion at Ole Miss really almost acts like a city, uh, you know, in its, of itself because there's so much activity that'll happen in here from athletic events to student events to concerts. So to play a game, we'll have two loading docks over here where 18 wheelers can come and drop stuff off. So really this is sort of the back of house, sort of yeah. the back door that allows the arena to function. So right now it's really a, a, a staging area for the contractor. We got sheetrock behind right, us. Right. They're going to leave this open so they, the last crane to leave the building will come out of here. Well, and it's all indoors. I mean, right now we don't have this over at the Coliseum. This will be something that we can do all right. this indoors basketball seasons in winter. A lot of times rain, cold. This will be really nice. Yeah, absolutely. This is, this is what modern first class arenas have is something like this that allows you to, to really function as a big time basketball arena. No doubt. Okay, Ross, we're on the west side of the pavilion. We're on the event level, but we're back in the locker room area. Back here we've got locker rooms for both the men's team, the women's team, we have coaches' lockers, we have a green room in case we do concerts, those type of things. Really a lot of different options in this area. So we're 40, 40 feet below ground right here. So this is the big giant hole that was dug yep. and all the dirt was moved and you're exactly right. So we saw where the team would be dropped off. We saw the loading dock area, but it's gonna be big time and, and, and showcase Ole Miss basketball. And then what's cool about this, we'll show people is how close we are to the court. Yeah, we're close. And then how tight the seating bowl is. And so let's go uh, check that part out. Let's do it. All right. All right, Ross, we are now in the upper level, the mezzanine level. And one of the things we talked about since we started designing this building is we wanted to make it an intimate atmosphere, a home court atmosphere. And as you can see, I mean, there's not gonna be a bad seat in this building. We're up here almost as high as you can go, and we're looking right down on the court. Just talk about you know, this, this vantage point. You know, we call this the mezzanine level. It's, it's really the upper deck, if you will. And as, as we've talked about, you know, between the, the tab pad and now the pavilion, even in the top row, you're sitting right on top of the court. And so, you know, the key point in all of this is that there's not a bad seat in the house. Right. You wanna support Ole Miss Athletics. You wanna support our, our basketball program. You want to come to a, a concert or a show or graduation, you're going to be right on top of the action, even if you are in the upper deck, so to speak. So this is a great perspective to show people that you buy a seat up here, you're in the game. And, and we want to do that. We want to make sure we market this the right way. And the purpose of this video is to get people this perspective that there's not a bad seat in the house. Okay, Ross, we're standing here on the east side of the pavilion. This is a really neat space. It's an area that we're gonna use really year round. We'll use it obviously for basketball season because right here is our uh, a pavilion club. A lot of our, our donors and fans will be there during basketball season. And obviously our stadium is here. We'll use this on a football game day. Talk about this space a little bit. You know, really, this is why we built 
the pavilion where we built it in, in this location to, to really synergize between a football game day experience and a basketball game day experience to be able to utilize the pavilion every day of the year right uh, to have football game day mean something for this building and then on a basketball game day we can utilize the the mystique of Vaughn Hemingway Stadium and all the things that come with it and so this is an unbelievable space that we can do a lot of different events a lot of programming and really give our fans something that we haven't had before and that's right. that's just a lot of elbow room as they enter Vaughn Hemingway Stadium so we're proud of this area and uh, we got a crane sitting here right now but that'll be moved out and uh, it'll be ready for football season. Okay, Ross, we're at the last stop of our tour today, but it's a very important area. Uh, this is the north end of the pavilion, kind of the front door, ticketing area, student area, food court. Talk about this area a little bit. So again, back to the vision of the whole athletic master plan. We got All-American Drive right here. Yep. We got the front door of the pavilion at Ole Miss. We got Vaughn Hemingway Stadium. We got our academic center. And really, this will be a place where students can just come and hang out. So if they finish a workout at the Turner Center, right. if they finish class and they want to walk to this part of campus so they park in the parking garage. They can really end up in here and just hang out. And then on game day, for basketball, it's obviously a, a, a lobby, a front door, a concession area. Football game day, we can really use this for hospitality in many ways, have these food court spaces open and really entertain in here like we've never done before. And, you know, so really now's the time to get on board and support this project, support our basketball team, support Ole Miss Athletics. You go to OleMissSports.com and click and give and contribute and, and just be a part of it. So we're excited about it. We're glad that everyone could join the tour of the Pavilion at Ole Miss. Please click on OleMissSports.com and check it out. Howdy toddy.